Well, good morning, good evening, good afternoon. The name's Defender, and welcome back to Day 5 of Hades. Previously, we attempted to escape using Aegis, the Shield of Chaos. Uh, we did not escape. In fact, we got stopped again by Elysium. Uh, so, yeah, but we did get got some stuff. We're going to do some more stuff. All right, good intro. Let's get going. and I, we've been holding back one of our greatest gifts to see if you were worthy. And you are. My aid is yours. So call me if you need anything, especially to smash your enemies to bits. Okay, so this introduces us to a new mechanic. Aid. So basically the idea is that, um, based on whichever boon that you get, you'll be able to call on that god's direct assistance. So here with Poseidon, your call makes you surge into foes while impervious for 1.2 seconds. The wrath of Poseidon at my beck and call. Press the Z uh, summon button to use your call, just like this. But as you can see, it requires the use of the god gauge, which is that uh, yellow bar that we have. It will fill up as you deal and take damage, but it does not carry over between encounters, so use it or lose it. Each time prince delves back into the underworld, its ever-shifting chambers realign to frustrate his attempts to perhaps map it out. Built to ensure no one gets out. We'll see about that. Well, it's working so far, so... Alright. Come on, let's fight. No sweat. Got a Chthonic key. Let's see, I think... Or is that the next run? I'm trying to think of when we, um... Are able to start doing the really cool stuff. I mean, not that what we've been doing before hasn't been cool, but you know how it is. Goddess Athena. You've met the master of the seas, Poseidon, haven't you? Our uncle's affable, but quick to anger. Be on your guard with him is my advice. That's probably good advice. Let's choose Divine Flourish. Hmm. How about Nectar? No, I've got Darker Thirst. I should get Darkness. I just want everything. Just just give it all to me. Oh, that'll be nice. <laughs> this is my wall of no projectiles, please. Hold on one second, please. Kids, this is why you always check your audio settings. Is that way you don't deafen people throughout your entire recording. So hopefully I sound much better now. Anyway, let's uh, let's get a Daedalus hammer. Sorry about that. I should have checked beforehand, but uh, I thought I knew what I was doing. There we go. It's just the edge I need. Hmm. I do like the chain shot. Thanks, Davis. Alright, more darkness. Oh, everyone's a big beefy boy in this room, aren't they? Dead. 
Uh, there's all that backstab damage coming in handy. Hmm. Well, let's go with Athena. Uh. Oh, yeah. Alright, you know what? Let's, uh... Also make foes exposed. Okay, take more backstab damage. Well, I guess we're gonna... Wow, so much Athena. I'm okay with this, though. Another Doomstone? No! Um, sorry. Wrong chamber. A sneak. And I'm locked in. So we'll have to act fast. So they'll either, uh appear really far away and try to shoot you, or they'll pop in really close and try to stab you. Just, you know, think fast. Unlike that. On you. Urgh. Get out of here. Back to the shadows. When I first notified Lord Father Zeus and other members of our family of your existence, Zagreus, it was Uncle Poseidon here who first leapt up and pledged his power over sea and earth to you. Is that not so, Uncle? Exactly so, Athena. You with that fine memory of yours. For it isn't every day I learn my doleful brother Hades sired a fine son. He does not know how good he has it there. And you, nephew, could have it even better here. Oh. A duo boon. Alright, let's get some unshakable metal. Let's go, team. That's what we like to see. The most violent wretches of Tartarus are sealed away even from other condemned souls. They're only visitors, those fool enough to attempt escape. Let's do this again sometime. Yes, let's. But not right now. Oh! Can catch my breath. Free gems! Okay. That's a lot of coin. Oh, I think I accidentally destroyed one of the golden urns, which gives us some extra obol. Let's go meet Sisyphus again. Ahoy. Oh. Hey, sir. Within the depths of Tartarus reside the most wretched of all the shades who linger for eternity within the underworld, whose lord and master is especially unkind to those attempting to cheat death. Lots of wretchedness to go around, I guess. I guess so. Uh, oh, here you go, Sisyphus. Hey, sir, thought this might ease your burden for a while. Now, hold a moment, Highness. I cannot accept something like this. Not without giving back a little something in return, that is. Got the Shattered that, Shackle. You know, Prince Ed, I'd not expected to run into you again. Not after all this time. Something I missed out in the house, or what? Not had much company of late, is all. Well, something's just about always amiss back home, sir. Figured it couldn't hurt to check up on things in Tartarus a bit more frequently. Well, I am grateful for it, I and the old boulder there, in turn. I'm used to going lengthy stretches on my own, but having visitors from time to time would do me well. As I think it would for everyone. Alright, I'm gonna take darkness, because, uh, my darker thirst will benefit me here. Here you are. Thank you, mate. Oh, good, a centaur heart. You love to see it. More numbskulls. Multi-kill. 
Ooh, yes. We are going to see a new mechanic. Once we clear this room. What do we have in the Well of Charon? Ooh, mm-hmm. It's very tempting, but you know what? I'm not gonna go for it. Okay, so this. As you can see, this is a new entrance, but it'll cost us some health. But it's like they say, nothing ventured, nothing gained. So all I need to do is sacrifice some of my life essence to go in here. I don't see why not. Who or what is Welcome that? to the realm of chaos. The deepest reaches of the underworld. The void from which all life and consciousness sprang forth during the dawn of time. The realm of chaos. A land almost unseen even to denizens of death's kingdom. Could you keep it down? Well, might as well, um, take whatever this is. This is not someone I recognize. So, in the name of Hades, um, hello, may I ask who's calling? Uh, I think this is a wrong number. Um, have we met? Well, we have met in a way. I know everybody here and there. You wish to leave this place? And it is my wish to make your doing so a little bit more interesting. And if you encounter the other beings someday, do give them my regards. Alright. So, this is chaos. Their boons are much more general, such as just increasing special damage or increasing dash strike damage. But as you can see, they come with a cost. For a certain number of encounters, you'll be inflicted with a penalty. You'll have to survive the, the requisite number of encounters before you actually get any benefits from it. So choose carefully. Let's go with... Let's go with Abyssal Flourish. I'll have to withstand the whims of chaos to extract the benefits a few chambers from now. Yep. All right, um, I don't have a lot of money, so I'm just going to get a palm. So, yeah, we got to survive three encounters where traps deal way more damage to us. And, uh, hopefully we can get some benefit from that. The power of the gods. Let's see, I'm going to upgrade Poseidon's aid. Okay, so, if you've already battled out of an area of the underworld... Uh, and have already collected the bounty from that area, you will obtain darkness on any subsequent attempts. Which can actually be something of a good thing. You can always use more darkness. Oh, hello. <laughs> Tell me something, Zack, because I'm curious. Do your Olympian relatives know the real reason you've been trying to escape? I'll get around to that in due time. The family. They'll understand, no doubt. Are you sure about that? You're in over your head, you idiot. You'll fray what bonds are left between Lord Hades and those ingrates on Olympus. Alright, so we'll just have to defeat Megara again. And again. Again. That's okay. I will say, I definitely would have liked to have more health, but, you know, you, you make do with what you got. And of course, there's always the, you know, 4,000 IQ play of just don't get hit, idiot. Which uh, I attempt to do with mixed results, as you've clearly seen. But yeah, you know what? I gotta say, um... Trying to produce content on a frequent basis is actually really hard. 
I wasn't anticipating how, how difficult it would be. But yeah, mad props to anyone who does this for a living. I have far more respect now. Not that I didn't before, but it's hard. You know what? Let's go. It's like a slip and slide of death. Ow. Take that. Yes, let's uh, let's end this. Look at all that skillful deflection. Man, I'm good at this. Get out of here. Oh yeah. Yes. For safekeeping. All right, let's uh, head on up. Well, father. Here's to a pleasant voyage up in Aspidel. Let's see. Ooh, that's really close to leveling up, so we'll just keep it. Let's think about this. I don't want to get rid of anything. It's in the well. Hmm. Well, you know what? Let's get some infernal troves going. Nah, I don't need it, because uh, I'll replenish some health. The path from Tartarus is finally laid bare. Far above, the heat from Phlegathon, the river of flame, is faintly felt already, even as its dangers lie in wait. Lovely. Next floor. <laughs> Up here. Well, we're back in Asphodel. Ooh, some obol, sweet. Definitely gonna need that. Well, it's really easy to shoot you when you just are continuously staggered and are standing there. I, I appreciate that immensely. Die. Must be the last of them. More Gorgons. I will admit, I definitely like to not... I'm glad I don't have to, you know, be very close to hit people. Any boons worth giving up? Hmm. No, I'll keep them. I mean, I know I'm a little strapped for cash, but not that much. Ah, oh, there's the infernal trove. All right, let's get some gems. Yeah, might as well. We have the trooper. Bring it. Wow, that is that is just a mess of enemies. There's so many of them. All this over some gemstones? That seems a little ridiculous, don't you think? That's quite enough. There we go. Mine now. All right, I'll just I'll take it, I guess. Definitely gonna choose more darkness. Enemies? Here's some money. Oh, I see them. Don't you know it's rude to, uh, to throw things at people? I mean, I mean, you probably do, but you just don't care. And that's why you're here in Asphodel. Dead. All right, just a few more. All 
All right, here comes Poseidon. You're dead. That's just so much fun. Man, we're gonna have so much darkness by the end of this, you won't even believe it. Uh... Hmm. You know what? Let's go for a palm. I'll try to make some more money before I stop by Charon's shop. Another chaos gate. All right. I like chaos. Although that's actually like not true to who I am as a person. Let me put it this way. If there if there was a, an alignment for me, I'd probably fall more on the lawful side if I'm being honest with myself. My boon from chaos is transformed. All right, so now my special deals plus 89% damage, and I no longer have to worry about traps. Power of Olympus. Hmm. Let's just get more special damage. Powered up. All right, let's see if there's anything worth breaking and or stealing. Lots of choices, but all of them stink. I'm going for chaos. Nothing here, and yes, you do have to give up health every time you want to go into chaos, so, you know. But generally, unless you're really starving for health, chaos is almost always worth it. Might as well. I'm back here. In the name of Hades. Let's see, what can we choose here? You know what? Let's take Caustic Strike. For the next four encounters, slain foes toss an Inferno Bomb at you. But then I get an attack bonus. Let's get that nectar. That sweet, sweet friendship juice. I have to wonder, is nectar like just Greek Sunny D? Nah, they'd probably drink something better than that. Ooh, there's... Is that is that a hot take? I don't think it is. At least I hope not. I mean, I haven't had Sunny D for... Oh, gosh. it's it, It's been years. Now, I just realized that I also haven't had any uh, Capri Suns in a really long time. I'm not, I'm not sure how to feel about that. Anyway, I'm not about to turn this into a um, fruity kids beverage tier list video. That's uh, I'll leave that idea for someone else. Someone more qualified than me. I, I don't know. But there, there's probably a surprising number of people who'd like to watch that. I mean, this is the internet. There's there's an audience for everything here. Who doesn't love this stuff? What's in the well? Ooh. Let's see here. Let me get that treasure and a health upgrade. Which way? Finally. Hmm. That will inter. You know what? Let's go to the new mechanic. I think that could be fun. Life threatening, but fun. Okay, so this. Is a trial of the gods. As you can see, there are two boons standing before you. Make your choice. Just uh, know that someone's feelings will be hurt. Say, word has reached me that you squared against one known as Theseus, now champion there in Elysium. He was a handful even when he lived. So much so that my honored brother Zeus, he took to calling him my son. Can you believe the nerve? Hmm. You know what, let's go with Boiling Point. So now it charges faster when I take damage. I thought we were on better terms, cousin. I ask only for your cooperation, yet still you turn your back. I 
need to do this, Athena. So yeah, whoever you don't pick will be very angry with you, and will then summon enemies, and will attempt to directly interfere with you. Depending on who you anger will change the effect. So for example, you can see Athena is granting the enemies uh, temporary invincibility. So you gotta watch out for that. Thankfully, you do get the boon of the other god if you manage to come out alive. Oh, and don't try- if you choose, um, if you anger the god who you have the call available, don't try to do it while you're fighting them. That just makes things awkward. I mean, you could try, it, 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 but it won't end well. Take that! What do you mean, there's more? Ugh. Here's a question. Should I spend my death defiance in the in the hopes that Athena will give me a boon that will let me get another one? Am I really that bold? No, I'll take the safe option. All right, the bone hourglass has reached its maximum level. We have better things to do, I think, than fight amongst ourselves over a matter such as this. Indeed. Let's go with Proud Bearing. You're gonna have so much God Gauge, you won't even believe it. Yeah, I'm gonna stop by Charon's shop. Let's see if I can't pick up a bite to eat. Oh, that is a sight for sore stomachs. Unfortunately, I actually can't get anything else, so. Care to provide me any insight as to just what sort of hideous monstrosity awaits me over on the next infernal island, Charon mate? Insightful. That bad, huh? Eh, just give me the food. Phew. It's better than spending another death defiance. Bone Hydra, you look different. Oh, more of these. Okay, so the yellow one generates um, a little skull capsules that will spawn armored enemies and that are armored themselves. And we'll also summon Skull Crushers, but thankfully the Skull Crushers will dissipate after they take damage, or after they crash land, so you don't have to worry about that. that even the little bone capsules spawn the Inferno Bombs. That's just annoying. All right, you know what? It's slip and slide time. Yeah, as you can see, calls are pretty good. You should definitely try to keep your eyes peeled for them if you can find them. Dead. You got that right. Really, that didn't blow up? Oh, okay, it's dead. Sweet. No touchy. I do not appreciate that. I'm gonna save my call for when the uh, other heads show up, just so that I can take care of them quickly and cleanly. 
Speaking of which... Oh, you move! That's upsetting. Get out of here. Take that! These Inferno Bombs are really cramping my style. I mean, I know this is exactly what I've gotten myself into, but I can still complain about it. Seriously. Come on, I want to get through this fight without spending my death defiance. All right, no more heads. Well, except this one, obviously. And now you spawn three of the blasted things. Thankfully, I can shoot you while you're having a tantrum. Uh-oh. Good riddance. Ah! Oh, that was close. Any more heads you'd like chopped off? No? I'll just take my darkness and go. All right, five health. You know, that's, that's, that's more than zero. Remember, the only hit point that matters is your last one. Still there, are you? Seems that way. Ah, all right. Hmm, what should I choose now? Okay, so the Shattered Shackle, your attack special and cast, each deal plus 50% damage while not empowered by a boon. This can lead to some very interesting builds, but uh, this is more of a late game keepsake since well, as we grow stronger and we just become more powerful baseline, this will become better. I think for now... You know what? I'm going to choose Distant Memory. Deal plus 10 damage to distant foes. Because, you know, okay. I have a bow. I shoot people from far away. Is good. Nope, those are good. Give me that darkness. And I'll try to collect some health. Because boy, do I need it. Enough of this place. Yeah, let's get out of here before we get sunburnt or something. Another day or night in paradise. You know what? Let's go with a Hermes boon. All right, so how many encounters do I have left with this... One more, okay. One more with the Inferno Bombs, and then we won't have to deal with uh, Inferno Bombs ever again this run for like the next 30 minutes or so, however much longer this takes. Hey, that extra 10% damage, it heads up over time. More arrows, more arrows for everybody. Please, I don't want to be run over. Oh, come on. Seriously. It's not fair that you could dash that many times in a row and I can't. 
he says while being able to dash twice in a row, which is more than what he could at the beginning, and is definitely more than what he could do in real life. My boon from Master Chaos has evolved. Alright, no more of those blasted inferno bombs. So now we just deal more attack damage. What's going on there, Cuz? Can I kill you, Cuz? I've got something here for you. Should make your battles to the death and that much quicker. Hmm. Ooh. Let's go with second wind. I do like second winds. Time to go. Oh yeah, let's go with Daedalus. Ooh, there's a shiny pot. No, I'm not interested in playing your stupid game. I'm interested in playing this game, Hades, but I'm not interested in playing the the I'm going to stab you repeatedly game. That, that, that's not fun. It's almost as not fun as dodgeball was in gym class. Almost. And the reason why that is worse is because I actually got hurt in that. So, you know, a little bit of bias there, but, you know. Just like dominoes. Except, you know, Greek. Stupid butterfly ball. Now, mix up my style. what to choose? You know what? I'm already dealing damage to disinfos. Let's just crank it up some more, why don't we? The deadliest bow of all. If it's worth doing, it is worth overdoing. All right, what's in the well? Show me, Charon. Definitely gonna try to get some more health. You know what? Let's just keep on the Hermes train. So many boons. Oh, flame wheels. What? How'd I miss all of you? I demand a refund. I was promised unerring accuracy with this bow. Clearly, I have not. That it was not. It has not been working as advertised. Sometimes I try to come up with like a joke but then I completely mess it up. I mean, I know that's nothing new for me, but I don't know. It's, there's a lot to keep track of. I'm realizing that this is a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I thought, oh, you know, I can just kind of zen out, shoot things or slash things or bash things, you know, whatever verb that I'm using to murder people with. But trying to do it while talking and not being blown up is really tough. <laughs> Alright, I'm fine. You know what? Just get hit again, please. Thank you. Olympus, I accept this message. Hmm. Let's just get quick favor. Your god gauge charges up automatically. Yes, more darkness, please. Sure, why not? Consider this a warning. What, you mean like all the other infernal tropes that we've had? Oh, the void stones, why? You make me sad. Come on, give me, yes! Plow through everything! Get out of here. Kaboom. Useless. All right, well. Hmm. Charon. Well, I actually really want the darkness. No way I can get some more money in this chamber, can I? The answer is no. And you know what? I'll just get a pump. Cheers, mate. Hmm. 
You know what? Let's get more baseline god gauge. That sounds like fun. And some darkness. All right, let's get a centaur heart, because I need some more health. Again, this low health, I'm not really a fan of it. So you may have noticed that the uh, God Gauge has multiple sections. You can, of course, store charges, but if you manage to fill the gauge all the way, you'll be able to perform a greater call, which generally, um, usually just has a longer duration, but it might have other effects depending on which call that you have. Generally, it is recommended to try to go for full, because uh, usually the longer duration or more powerful effects are generally just worth the wait. Though, of course, if you need to use one earlier, don't hesitate to do so. Because remember, you don't get to keep any god gauge between encounters. But let's show off Greater Call for Poseidon. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Donk. I'd say that went pretty well. Killed three annoying enemies, no time flat. Get out of here. Heh <laughs> There's another Chaos Gate. What are my rewards? Another Centaur Heart. I'm sorry, Master Chaos, I need the health. Well, if you all just wanna line up real nice like that, I'll just bowl all of you over. Well, I, th I definitely think I know what I'm titling this episode uh, when it goes up. That's also been another kind of hard thing, figuring out what uh, titles to use. It hasn't been too hard right now, because there's, you know, when there's new mechanics to talk about, you can always make a nice title out of that. But uh, once I get further along, it'll be a little more difficult, but uh, that's part of the, the fun, is it not? Man, those long distance shots, they're so good. Oh, I, I couldn't go through the wall. There we go. Yummy. I can chew, well I can't, ch I have to take the palm, so I guess I'm just gonna take the palm and like it. Never actually had a pomegranate. Are they any good? I actually quite like a whole uh, myriad of fruits. I like apples. I like bananas. I, I like oranges and grapes. Um, watermelon's all right. It would not be my first choice. I will definitely say that. Yeah, it's just, it's just kind of hard to eat fruit because, well, you know, depending on the fruit that you pick, it can go bad relatively quickly. So it's, you know, you, if you get it, you gotta kind of eat it quick. If it's something like a banana, you know, those, those things rot real quick. I think one of the, um, humanoid enemies regenerated. Actually, both of them did, but that's okay. I'll just run you over again. <laughs> if at first you don't succeed, co uh, commit vehicular homicide again and again. God's grant me strength. Let's increase boiling point. Juicy. So now I charge more of my God gauge when I take damage.
You know what? Let's go meet that, uh... How many keys do I have? I have five. Hmm... Uh, key. Normally I would not make such a choice, but um, we need a lot of keys in the early game, so I'll just keep collecting them. Take my cast back, thanks. It's really nice to be able to take care of those flame wheels from a distance. What are my arrows being absorbed by? Well, whatever, you're dead. Merely delayed the inevitable. I'm gonna hold on to my gauge in case of more enemies show up. Alright, hey, what do you know? More enemies. Alright, here I come. It is where do you think you're going, young man? What do you mean there's more? This place is just crawling with enemies. There's that bonus damage. Right there. Mine. Let's see. Worth it. Yeah, I'll take the hydrolite. Well, let's see, I just spent my money, so I'm gonna get a centaur heart. Well, good for the health. All right. Well, this is where we got stuck the last time we uh, arrived with Koronokt. Hopefully, we'll do a little better this time. Three match. What hope of you, monster, versus the blessed bonds of brotherhood? Well, I've already defeated you one time previously, so I think I can do it again. That's not the little M King. He is more powerful than he appears. We must remain alert this time. Oh, I am perfectly alert right now, Asterius. And were I still alive, I would be positively salivating at the thought of running through this pustule with my spear, or whichever means I had available. Now let's go. Is... Did... Dude, do you have, like... A murder boner or something, cause like, that is, that is a concerning level of joy over the prospect of violence. Like, I mean, I'm all for a good fisticuff or something like that, but that's just, that's just a little extreme, don't you think? Ow. Time to just, you know, bowl this guy over. Did you see how much damage we just did? Incredible. Oh no. I'm all right. Oh, do oh, believe me, I am. Such coming from this crowd. 
Really? You can hear the crowd over all of the violence? I mean, I guess they are pretty loud, so... Eh. It's slow going, but uh, we're doing it. Let's go. All right. All right, King, come at me. This Kong has a funny face. Oh, that 288 damage. That was nice. I mean, I am. Have all the arrows in your back not uh, alerted you to the fact that you are, in fact, being hurt by me? All right, sure. I'll keep shooting you. I'm all right with this. Interesting. He summons someone that we haven't actually chosen a boon from yet. Interesting. I didn't even know he could do that. All right. It's Poseidon time again. Why evade? when I can just not take damage. Ah, oh, no, I don't want to be there. You're the one who keeps running away from me and keeps throwing their spear at me. I must say, I'm not a big fan of like the frozen after effect. That definitely stinks. You know what, you're, you're just getting charged. Oh, I have another one, all right. All right, more ambrosia. That shade there. Have I got a fan? It sure looks like we do. Well, we're gonna have to not disappoint them now. Hope you enjoyed the show. What a receptive audience. Your struggles soon shall be in vain. So you keep saying. Let me get my health back. I'm gonna keep the distant memory. Yeah, I'm not going to get rid of anything. Will, however, replenish more health. I can do this. I can do this. Well, we're back in the Temple of Sticks. Just got to get through Cerberus up there. And also Hades. Don't forget about Hades. Or are you trying to forget about Hades, Zagreus? All right, so we do have to, oh, lore spot. The vast temple of Styx and its innumerable dangers 
Now are all that separates the Underworld Prince from the land outside, which he so desperately longs to see. I've almost made it. So yes, we do have to get another Seder Sack each time we go through here. Um, let's start with... Centaur Heart. We can keep doing this all day, mate. Right, I'm gonna take care of the snake stone first, cause I just I hate the lasers so much. All right, that's just it's so good. It's so good. So long, trash. Oh, that is a lot of vermin. Like, an unnecessarily massive number of vermin. There's also a little of Charon. Really, you missed Zagreus? All right, who's next? Oh, you're armored too. That's not ideal. Oh, I got another one. All right, sweet. No, I don't want to play laser jump rope. Thank you very much. That's something. More darkness. All right, well, let's uh let's go find another tunnel. Hmm. How about Ares. We haven't gotten a boon from him this run. Why do these vermin carry coin? I don't know. Just just take it, Zagreus. Both have coin in them. Don't take it for granted. And also just pick it up. Avoid the big old saw blades because clearly that those were around in Greece. Oh, you're just all Mondo dead. All right. This this is too good. Definitely can't get arrogant now, not while we're so close to the end. Because, as another good indie game once said, overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Oh! Hey, a Sata sack already. Lucky us! Alright. Lots of coin there. What you got for us, Ares? Three titans in one shot back in the war amongst our kind. Please do take care of it. Hmm. Let's just get more overall damage. The war god's power. A sack fit for a huge three headed hound. Oh. Right, that's my health. Oh, a lore spot. 
deep within the desecrated layer of the god-defiling satyrs lie the noisome contents of their profane rituals, so foul as to be indescribable. Cerberus just loves the stuff. I guess that's all we need to know about it. That's all I want to know about it. Maybe I should check the other passageways before I leave. Alright, so we could do that, but honestly, because there's not going to be any more fountains after the Seder Sack, I think I'm just going to go for it. Of course, after bu stopping by the shop. Ooh. Alright. One last health upgrade. And one last palm. Let's just get more overall damage. I got your favorite treat right here, Cerberus. Cerberus again accepts the sack. Thank you, boy. <laughs> He's fine. That's very important. My conscience has been eased. All right, well, the first fight with Hades didn't go so well. Maybe things will be different this time. I'm here, Father. Come on. The sea, the heavens, and the earth. All of this belongs to my brothers. We are their kin by birth. But we are foreigners in their country. No. No mournful speeches. Now get out of my way. You impertinent brat. Fine. Impulsiveness runs and the family shut up here goes where to go don't worry about that right now zagreus Observe. too close got to remember my special shot to flex Oh, look at all that damage! I'm gonna wait until Hades summons his first round of backup, and then I'm gonna Greater Call. Come on, summon your mooks already. There we go. What shall it take for you to cease making me face you here? I think that was a good use of uh, Poseidon's aid. Get that out of here. Here comes a shockwave. Oh, good. The call to darkness. Yeah, I love it so much. It should be noted that um, when Hades does go into darkness, whatever debuffs he had will disappear. Though it's, you know, not really that hard to apply them again. Oh. Oh, 
has to keep curving out of the way of my special. Are you serious? What a lunge that was. You know what, I'm just gonna go for it. Keep racking up that damage. All right. Unfortunately, Hades has chosen some very annoying enemies this time. None of that, please. Oh. This is boiling blood, so I'll take more damage for a moment. Now I know what you're thinking. You've won. To have been brought this low by my own ungrateful child, I would expect such treatment from my brothers, but from you. What kind of game do you think this is? It's not a final boss, unless there's a second phase. Okay, so now Hades will no longer go into darkness or summon enemies. But as you can see, he now has this kind of vicious laser attack with which he'll try to torch you. His other attack that he learns involves summoning these jars, which, as you can see, if they are damaged either by you or by Hades, they will summon those grabby hands, which not only deal big damage, but will keep you in place. And as you can see, he's now added a multi-combo to his attack, where he'll take some swipes before performing his uh, spin attack. More jars, all right. Thankfully our special will let us destroy a lot of them quickly. Enough of you. If you get into trouble, you can stand behind the pillars to avoid the laser attack. I'll just stay here, I think. I'll just wait. Play the play it slow and patient. This is intense, yo. Also, if you get hit by the beam, you will slow down, so really don't get hit by it. Okay, when he gets down to half health, his attacks will increase in ferocity even more. 
He'll, his attacks will become faster. And when he performs his laser attack, as you can see, it now sweeps the whole area. You brought this on yourself. And yes, as you can see, even the shockwaves from the casts will destroy the jars. Is your name Hades or Jarvis? How many of these darn things are you going to even summon? No! And sweaty, mom spaghetti. Just gonna wait, wait, wait. Oh, no more! Somehow find her. Tell her something for me. Tell her. Tell her Cerberus is doing very well. What? Wait, I don't think I owe you any favors here. Now answer me one question and I'll give her some thought. How's that? I know your question, boy. But ask it anyway. Persephone. My mother. Why did she leave? I... Blood and darkness. There is no escape. Goodbye, father. I did it. I actually did it. Wow. <laughs> that was my fifth attempt. It took me 13 attempts on my first file. Wow. Uh, okay. Alright, hold on. Let me, let me just, let me, let me, let me get my heart rate under control here for a moment. Holy crap, that was intense! But we get another drop of Titan blood. My weapon shuddered at the touch of it. We did it! We're free! <laughs> Let's go! I made it. Grease. Beyond the frozen overlook, await the first glimpse of the sun to your left, and onward through the cold. Oh. Sure hope this works, Nix. I think it will. It has to. Wow. Um, uh, <laughs> I was, wow. Really? Only five attempts? I thought it was going to take me at least double that. 
I guess not. The surface, windswept, racked by freezing cold, nonetheless instills within the prince a sense of awe and the sublime, for it is unlike anything that he has seen. It's beautiful. It is. Let's just, just drink this all in. Oh, Zagreus, are you? I hope you're not catching a cold. That thing, that's the sun. Yeah, that's the sun, all right. Don't look at it directly, though, or you'll melt your eyeballs. all green um um hello that's what i was going to say you must be persephone pray who might you be wandering all the way out here you're trespassing on private property you know speak up um you must be persephone my name is zagreus and I think I might be your son. What? How dare! Get out of here! Get out or I shall make you! Out with you! No, so then you are her. I, I don't care if you hate me, but I'm not leaving until I get some answers. I never even knew you existed. Why did you leave me? You died! You... You died! Those burning feet, they... sputtered out when you were born. But why are you standing here before me? How? I died. I died. What, you mean permanently died, but I'm alive? Oh, gods. You never even knew I existed either. Alive? Sagrius, he even kept your name. You live. How can this be? You live. You live. Oh, the cruel fates! My son! Mother. Time passes. In short, I beat him, finally, though he did everything he could to prevent our meeting here like this. But there's something he wanted me to tell you in the end. He said to tell you Cerberus is doing very well. Ah, uh, he told you that, did he? That's good. That's good. Though, tell me something, Zagreus. How is it that you found me? To have journeyed all this way, I scarce believe it. Zagreus? Uh, oh, it's... Guess I'm just a little tired, that's all. Not accustomed to the weather, as I think you call it. No. No, that isn't it. It's that... You cannot stay here. You can't stay here. Really, you're... <laughs> kicking me out? Why? The fates are cruel, Zagreus. You're bound to that place. Same as your father. So they would have us say goodbye. For now. My heart soars knowing you live. But then it breaks that our time together was so brief. No. I can... Come back. I can come back. Now that I found you, he... Maybe he'll just let me come back. You tell him I demand it. And I demand he also tell me how come he, or for that matter, Nyx, never sent notice that you lived. Olympus is all rife with schemers. But I was so naive to think that they were different. I'll tell him. I'll tell him. I feel awful. I... I have to go. The stick shall take you then. Oh, Zagreus. 
Farewell, my son. Won't you come back to me? When you are able, please, come back. I shall be waiting here. However long it takes. Of course. However long it takes. <gasps> Can't hold on. Uh, mother, I have to get back there. Right. Where's Hades? Those shades are always milling about. Ought to spend some of these gems with the house contractor. Later, Zagreus. You are late, boy. Have you any idea what time it is? No. Wait, what? I vanquished you in single combat and finally found mother, and that's all you have to say to me. <laughs> Nonsense. Don't you think I would recall such an event? You can't be serious. You're going to pretend as though it never happened. She wants answers, same as I do. She demands you let me pass. Let me go to her again. Silence. This discussion is over. I hardly think this is the time or place to indulge your overwrought imagination. I know where we can continue this discussion, then. Okay, so Hades has either suffered blunt force head trauma, or he is lying. Probably the latter. Great. Alright, well, you know what? We proved we could do it. So we just have to do it again. I found her, sir. My mother, she's alive and well, and... Uh, but I just couldn't stay up there for very long. I have to get back to her. You really made it all the way? You must have gotten past your father, that's amazing, lad. But wait, what was she like? What happened to you there? She was... she was great. Nothing like father, more like you a little bit, I guess. Though being on the surface, it just seemed to suck the life right out of me. Even without the wretches of the underworld trying to do me in. But then you had a little time at least. Sounds like you have unfinished business with her there. You got to her this once. Surely you're able to again, isn't that right? It is. I have to speak with her. Right. Alright, let's see what we can buy with gems. Whoa, a rod of fishing. Here. A rod of fishing. Scoop creatures from the underworld's rivers. Now, I know what you're thinking. This seems like a gimmick item, right? Wrong! It's really good. Get it. Here you go. I positively cannot wait to see what sorts of foul creatures I'll dredge up with this. Cheap blessing from Poseidon on a stick and nothing more. Hey, considering Poseidon just helped us kick your ass, I think you should hold your tongue, Hades. Uh, let's see. Let's get some fountain chambers in Elysium. Here you go. I'll be on the lookout for this when I'm in the area. I shall review this work once the time permits. Alright, so we've got more things we can do. But not enough materials to do anything with it, so we'll move on. Oh, hello, Zagreus. You look a little down. And so I was just wondering, would you perchance fancy a song right now? How about In the Blood? How about In the Blood? That's one of your old hits, right? Oh, fancy that one, do you? Alas, I've not the heart to sing it anymore. I'm glad you like it, though. Child. Hello, Nix. Your father fell to you as once his father fell to him. Although you were substantially more merciful. I know it is a bitter victory at best. Though, tell me, what transpired subsequently that you have returned? Did you locate your birth mother? I did. I... She was there. She was where you said she'd be, and more than I imagined, but I had so little time with her. I can't survive up there for very long. Why didn't you tell me I'd just die no matter what? Oh, my child. I say this seldomly, but I did not know, or I did not wish to believe, that the surface would have such an effect on you. But it seems you share your father's fate, after all. My father's fate. But he was smugly waiting for me up there and seemed quite healthy all in all. Though, maybe the farther we get from this realm, the worse we get. Because he cast his lot, inheriting the underworld. 
So I now presume you are bound to this realm by powers greater even than mine. Tell me something. If you knew that you could only see Persephone for but a moment's time, would you still make the journey to her there? Yes. Yes, I would. I had so many questions left for her. Then go and ask them, child. Set your resolve and find her there again. And use well what brief time you have with one another whilst you can. As mortals do. Of course. As mortals do. Thanks for everything, Nix. Here, take this. Um, Nix? You've done so much for me, I thought you might like this. You know your father does not like it when nectar is doled out on the premises, dear child. However, I am not he, and I wished regardless to provide you a token of my affection. I'm very grateful, Nix. Obtained the black shawl. And, oh! Hey, the lounge is open. The lounge is open again. Excellent. A commemorative board adorns one of the stoic walls within the lounging area, celebrating and proclaiming the accomplishments of those who serve Lord Hades best of all. Won't ever see my face up on that wall, I guess. Guess not. Oh, hello, Meg. Zagreus, please tell me that the rumors are untrue. You really vanquished him. Have you completely lost your mind? You're going to destroy this blasted house. Come on, Meg. Father had it coming for some time. What's your concern besides? The house is safe. He's not going to take this lying down. He'll find some way to take it out on you, on all of us. You watch yourself or all of us will pay. I will not let that happen. Right. Also, hello. <gasps> oh, the prince himself. You want to talk to me? Me? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Uh, this is uh, Dusa. I uh, just wanted to say the lounge looks wonderful, as good as new. Better. I hope it's not been too much trouble patching up. I, 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 ow, I have to clean the rafters. I... Thanks for all your hard work. Well, uh, goodbye. Ah, so this is the Wretched Broker. broker. As you can see, you can trade items for other items. Uh, this will be one of the more common ways in which you will obtain items, but... Generally, in the early game, it's better to hold on to your stuff to use it. Um, but as you can see, the bottom item is always a limited time offer, which is something special that the broker never usually offers. And it's only available once per escape attempt, so keep it in mind. Alright, well, um, let's go. Wow, okay. I'm still trying to get over the fact that I actually escaped on my fifth attempt. This is going to throw everything out of whack. But, uh, hmm. I guess this is how it's going to have to be. Prophecy fulfilled. We escaped, and we get a thousand darkness. I broke free after all. Sort of. <laughs> Let's see, there are still more people to meet. There's still a lot more to do. Don't worry, even though we have escaped, we are far from complete. All right. Let's get those talents. Show me something new. All right, so we have Boiling Blood, deal bonus attack and special damage to foes with casts in them. And Infernal Soul, raises your supply of bloodstones to cast. But uh, I'm going to go with Death Defiance, because I like not dying. And you know what? We're going to go up to max. Three whole charges now. Dang. Let's see, we need more keys to unlock more talents, so we'll just uh, pump up what we can. Only one darkness left. I guess Darker Thirst was really good there. Excellent. Ah, feel that darkness course through me. The exit. That's a pact of punishment on it. A what now? Oh. What's going on, Skelly? Give you a piece of advice, boyo. You run across a guy like me out there, you just give him a good stab right in the back without a second thought before he sends you crying back to Papa. I'll keep that in mind, mate. Okay, so... Let's see, what... I can't do anything with this. That has darker thirst. Mmm... You know what? 
I'm gonna choose Varatha. Might as well give a new weapon to spin. What's this one do? All right, so since uh, distant memory works best with projectiles, we're gonna unequip it. We have a new item, the Black Shawl. Deals plus 10% damage, striking undamaged foes and striking foes from behind. Let's see. Um, you know what? I'm gonna take the old spiked collar. I'm gonna increase my maximum health. All right, so as we can see, the window is much more sinister, you know, with the orange glow and the big skull above it. But um, I think I'm gonna talk about that next time, because I was honestly not anticipating having to talk about this already, because we still haven't even unlocked everything we can do in runs yet, because, again, I was not anticipating actually succeeding, but uh, here we are, so uh, I have no idea how things are going to play out from here, but uh, it's going to be really exciting, so thank you for watching. If you'd like to stay up to date on the things that I do, I have a Twitter, a Discord, and I also stream on Twitch. But yeah, I don't really have anything else to say, except for now, this is The Defender, signing out. See you later.